This is Code.org. I'm currently working on CS Fundamentals, and the lesson I'm on is For Loops with Artist. I'm on Puzzle 7. If you turn a little bit more or less than you normally would for a shape, it creates a neat effect. Recreate your code from the last level. If you didn't do the last level, go back and do it. Uh, if you're stuck on it, watch my video. But turn 89 degrees to recreate this twisted square spiral. Okay, this icon means this level's part of a larger project. Changes will be saved across. Okay, cool. Oh, and the blue. All right, so I remember in the last uh, puzzle, we had not a for loop. And then for our for loop, we were going to do, we started at 15, remember? And then we went all the way to 300. Because it originally started out as a square um, at, with a repeat inside, but we got rid of the repeat. And then each side was 15. Now, what did we do? Well, we moved forward by counter. So we'll move forward by 15, hit the bottom, go back by 30, 45, and we'll draw a line each time. And to get the turning effect, what we had was a left turn. And it was originally a 90 degree because we were making squares from the puzzle before that. They want us to test out 89. Let's give it a shot. And if you're stuck on the concepts that we just did here, make sure you go back to the last two puzzles, five and six. Check out my videos, too, if they aren't making sense. All right, let's give this a shot. This is cool. But uh Oh, that's super cool. And so all we did was change one number, but it gets bigger and bigger, of course. Huh. All right, let's keep going.